What is up guys, Jeremy here and welcome back to another video. So I'm going to show you guys how you can install an IPA onto iOS 13, no jailbreak required and also no computer required. This is actually really, really cool and we will be doing it through AppCake. AppCake allows you to install IPA files, which is amazing. Now, if you guys need to see how to get AppCake, I will leave my tutorial on how to install it down in the description. So if you guys want app cake, be sure to check that out. But the application I'm going to show you guys how to install in this video is screenshot X. This is an application that isn't available in the app store. Normally you have to add a source on a chill broken device like Insidia and install the application that way. But since we have a direct download for the IPA, we can install it using app cake, which is really cool. Now, if you guys didn't know what screenshot X is, uh, basically, it allows you to take a screenshot and put it into an iPhone frame and you can share it. And there's a bunch of cool like scenes and setups. As you guys can see, these are the singles. You have doubles here. So if you wanted to feature two different screenshots and then there's also the scene style, which I really like these ones here. And you just select on uh, whatever scene you want. You can add a photo or a screenshot just by clicking on it like that. And then you can save it directly to your camera roll. Seriously cool. It's really nice, especially on Twitter when you're trying to show off your setups or your jailbreak themes, uh, tweaks and stuff like that. Very, very cool application to have. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to delete it off of my device. Let's go ahead and, and delete it. So we can download the IPA from the developers discord. So that's where I'm going to get it. I'll leave the link for it down in the description. But if you guys want this, I would highly recommend uh, following June's iPhones. Um, discord for this uh, just because there's a lot of cool stuff going on on discord but like i said i will leave the uh the link for this in the description but if we go to pins here in the general chat and if we scroll all the way down here we should see there it is right there the screenshot app for iphone 10 uh, and then here is the direct download to the ipa so we can go ahead and just click uh, select on that and this is going to work for any ipa so as soon as you find the ipa you want all you got to do is download it. That's literally all you got to do. We'll do continue on to website, download, direct download. So any IPA you guys can think of, I'm just doing screenshot X as a uh, demonstration. As you can see, once you download the IPA, you get the option to open in app cake. Just go ahead and select on that. And then if we go into downloads here, as you can see, I just installed it again. Already had it installed, so we'll actually just delete the old one here. We'll select on the new one and click on install. Now it's gonna extract it, resign the application, and then reinstall it onto our device. As you can see, just click on install there. We can exit out. And as you can see, there is Screenshot X on our non-jailbroken iOS 13 device. Such a cool trick. Being able to install IPAs with AppCake, I think is, is seriously amazing. As you guys can see, it does work. We'll go into my photos, recents. Let's do this, this wallpaper here and we can save it just like so. And that is how you use AppCake to install IPAs without a computer standalone on your iOS 13 device. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Like I said, if you guys want to see how to get AppCake, I will leave the link down in the description. Also, if you guys want any of the wallpapers you guys have seen, be sure to check out my telegram. The link for that is in the description as well. Uh, but anyways, this has been Jeremy and I will catch you guys in the next one later.